everyone, welcome to Wireman's Whimsy. Today we are going to make this pretty get well card uh, using the Blossoms in Bloom stamp set. Uh, no fancy die cutting, no fancy anything. It's simply putting ink on paper. This is a pear pizzazz card base with a white cardstock five and a quarter by four. And we are just going to stamp, stamp, stamp. And that's all we're gonna do on this card but it still is really pretty and really effective. We're going to start with the largest of the stamps and use Cal Calypso Coral on it. Make sure that's inked up really well. And then we'll just put this down and place this down on the paper, giving it a good press to make sure we've got good coverage. And there we go. Okay, so we'll put that off to the side for now. We'll close this up. And then we are going to use our pear pizzazz and just add some leaves. We're just gonna tuck them in here and here. We'll put one on the side there. We can tuck one in here and pop one in here as well. Okay, so now I am actually going to switch out of my pear pizzazz and come in with the uh, basic gray. And with the basic gray, I'm going to stamp the greeting along the bottom edge here. There we go, just like that. And then I'm going to use the uh, flower centers and just come in here and pop the middles into the flowers. And then I'm going to come back in with some more pear pizzazz and a smaller leaf and just add a little bit of color in between the flowers. I'm also going to come in with the pool party and add some flowers with pool party as well. So we'll just keep adding in until we're happy with the color. Okay, and then we're going to use one of the small flowers um, with the pool party. And we are going to just come in and just add some little flowers wherever it seems we need some. And you can just keep adding and adding until you are happy with what you've got. And you can add as many or as few. You can add another color if you want to. I'm just going to pop these in here, maybe another one in there, and one up here, um, having a look, and maybe just one more down here. Okay, so that's all uh, done like that. Now, I thought that this was just a little bit plain. I didn't like the stark white in the middle, so I came in with petal pink, and I'm just blending the petal pink in. And you'll notice that I'm not stamp or not uh, starting off the page. With these ones, it's okay if I get that kind of little halo shape because I'm putting it right in the middle of the flower to start with. So I'm just going to be rubbing it around just so that the flowers aren't completely white in the background. So it just takes the edge off that white a little bit. And then I'm going to come in with another brush and some pear pizzazz just around the edges because again, I felt it was just a little, a little plain around the edges. So I just came in and just did some blending around the edges just to add a little bit of color. 
take some of that stark whiteness out. Then we're simply going to adhere it to the front of the card and we are done. Nice, quick and easy, simple card, no die cutting required, no special steps, just ink and stamps. So thank you very much for watching today and we will create together again soon.